There have not been many studies about the effect of the antidepressants, which we know reduce depression very effectively, but we don't know what effect they have on endpoints, particularly in older women who are more likely to use antidepressants uh, than are men. Women ages 50 to 79 were enrolled in this long-term follow-up study, and so we had the opportunity to look at the effects of antidepressants. These women were not on any antidepressants at the baseline when they enrolled into the Women's Health Initiative. About 5,500 of them went on antidepressants by the time of their first follow-up visit, which was usually one to three years after the baseline. We compared those women who went on antidepressants to the women who did not go on antidepressants. Our findings were published in the December issue of the Archives of Internal Medicine. Our central findings were that older women who went on antidepressants had an increased risk of stroke, but not of coronary heart disease. But they did have an increase in risk of death from all causes. Women on antidepressants had an excess risk of 45% above the risk for women not on antidepressants. But people mostly are interested in what is my risk of getting a stroke. For someone not on antidepressants, their risk of having a stroke was 0.3% per year, whereas among women taking antidepressants, it was about 0.5, 0.4, or 0.5%, which is less than 1%, half of 1%. Depression is a very debilitating condition. Depression itself is a risk factor for cardiovascular disease and for death and uh, for other conditions. So there's very good reason to treat depression. Older women who do take antidepressants should be very vigilant about their other cardiovascular risk factors. They should exercise, they should maintain a healthy weight, they should certainly control their blood pressure, they should certainly not smoke, they should control their cholesterol. Actually, it's what all women should do.